Welcome back, everyone, to the Kublai Khan Casino and Resort Hotel and Sports Bar and Spa here in beautiful downtown Las Vegas, where what stays in Vegas stays in Vegas. I'm Rich Murdoch, and as always, I'm joined by former Extreme Poker Super Ninja Champion, Danny Freeberg. Always a pleasure, Rich. Today's Cinderella story is Franklin Elway, a simple cattle mulcher from northeastern West Bank, who has been surprising us all all day long. Darn right, Danny. Elway flipped the knob straight on a wide elbow in the first round and caught the balls short of a flip pair with a narrow flush in the second. Let's see if he can continue his streak and nut flop a tilt on his backhand here in round three at our feature table. Well, we're joining the table already in action, and the table is no limit Viking secret wildcard poker. Right now, Elway is trailing 25,000 to 38.6 billion against the newcomer Desmond Lamont. Here's the deal, Lamont gets an ace of clubs and a joker, which doesn't help him much because of course in Viking secret wildcard poker, jokers are anti-wild and may lead to a squashed spin if another one comes up on the flaps. Elway, however, gets a king of diamonds and Mrs. Bun the baker's wife, so he's already in a very good position for a spin flush. Play is to Lamont, who bets 2,000, over to Elway, who takes his time to see that bet. Both men check, and it's on to the knuckle. No help to either player there with Elder Dragon legend Vivictus Osmati. That's a real shame for Elway, because Chromia might have actually helped him despite his lack of mana. Looks like he's still betting, though. Elway bets the chicken there. Lamont sees the chicken with a memory card containing compromising photos of Gandhi and one of his followers. Both men check, and it's time for the flaps. And look at those flaps! The Three of Clubs, the Eight of Hearts, Sir Robin's Minstrels, and Colonel Mustard with the candlestick. That really evens up the playing field. Right now, Elway's gonna have to decide if he should hold the knob steady, cut the straight along his outside felt, or scrump all his grits in one trug and go ahead with the check. Wow, Lamont is clearly confident that he has the better hand, and he's put Elway in a tight spot. I wouldn't be surprised if Lamont pulls out a full undercrunch moonsault. And Elway checks. And a spin from Lamont. Alpha. Double indemnity. Splish. Splash. Twist. Flip. Elway taking his time here. Gargle. My god, Rich, this is astounding. We haven't seen a twist, flip, gargle play since 1972 at Constantine's Palace. Lamont put Elway into a back-ended flip, and Elway did not back down. This is the sort of hand every poker fan lives for. Both men have a roughly equal chance at this point, so it all comes down to the pants card. Here's the deal. Uno! And it is all over. Against all the odds, Elway has done it. He crunched a heavy twist, let Lamont flip his gargle, and it completely paid off. The winner, Franklin Elway, your Super Mecha Godzilla Viking Champion for 2008 and forever.